hello everyone welcome back to my little channel i hope you guys are having an amazing day um if you guys are new here please subscribe and leave me a little comment on what you guys thought about the nails also don't forget to check out my online store zule nail shop um the link's going to be in the description for all the products that i'm using Oh, bam. Okay. Hello. Senoritas, let me put a little cuticle oil because, girl, my little dryness. Hello, everyone. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Dude, let me put cuticle oil before everybody shows up. Hello guys, welcome. How are you guys doing today? All right, so today we have Marta in the house. Say hi to Marta, everyone. <laughs> she wants a little bit of purple, a little bit of orange, something kind of different. Hola, everyone. Bienvenidas. ¿Cómo están? Hello, Zule. Hello, Marta. <laughs> I'm going to be using my smooth set monomer as usual. Hi, everyone. So those of you guys who are here early, these are the colors that we're going to be using today. I need more glue. Girl, come get some. Come get some. No, she's not wiggly today. All right. So these are the colors that I'm going to be using today. It's going to be... La Dreamy or Lil Dreamy or something like that. I may have wrote it wrong, but it's something dreamy from the Gangster Collection. Marta's a little crazy today. She's like, girl, I want purple, but I want orange at the same time. So we're going to see how it comes out. I'm going to be using the color Coqueta because it has a little purple glitter in it. La Dreamy, that's what it's called. Okay. All right. So check it out. This is Coqueta. has a little bit of glitter. So pretty. If you guys haven't tried that color, y'all playing games. I don't know if I should use the color Tropical or if I should use the color um, Sharon. And I'm also going to be using G10. So I'm thinking that Tropical, huh? Because that one's a little brighter. I don't fucking know. Maybe Sharon. You, oh, you guys want to see Sharon? All right, I haven't used it. All right, look at it. This is so pretty. Sharon, comadre. Okay, look, it's so pretty. Well, I don't know. I'll probably use them both, actually. I'll open it just in case. All right, let's open her up. So that way you guys can share with people that are joining later, okay? Hey, Zule, it's me who texted you about going live. Hello, welcome. So I'm going to start off by doing a little Frenchie. Um, Marta wants a French, she wants a French set today. So that's what we're going to kind of do. She hasn't decided how many she wants. Hello, everyone. Welcome. Zule, I just did a poly gel set with the Marta Plazzetti. Ooh, I'm going to need to see that. That sounds so beautiful. What powders are these? These are um, from my website from my brand so if you guys would like to shop you guys can definitely shop link on bio um this color is coqueta i will be trying to name them what the fuck i'm stuck hold on oh, oh there you go am i lagging am i lagging for you guys or was it just my phone because I didn't have it on Wi-Fi. All right. So these nail tips are our 3XL squares. No? Okay, 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 good. It's because I'm using my other phone to look at the live, but I didn't have it connected to Wi-Fi, so it kind of like buffered a little bit. 
All right, so Marta requested um, Frenchies, at least. I think she wants at least two Frenchies. Do you have a timer set? Not yet. So um, I came in at eight. So by nine, I hope to rem remember. She wants them a little deep. She says she likes it deep. So that's what we're going to give her. All right, Marta, be a good girl today. Ooh, you're doing your hand right now. Nice. Nine, 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 nine. Are these your tips? Yes. Everything that I'm using tonight, you guys can find it on my website. The link is on the bio. These are the three Excel tips. And somebody did ask me um, that, where's this hand from a little bit ago? It's from RedIguana.com. Um, I don't have a discount code with them anymore, but I do recommend the hands. They are the best quality I've I've bought so far. Welcome, senoritas. Welcome. You guys are right on time. Marta's over here requesting some funny colors today. She says she was a little inspired by um her walk that she went on. Hey, just kidding. That was me. Hey, just kidding. How's everybody doing? Happy Monday. All right, so I'm just going to finish my little Frenchie. I like to work in sections. We need more packing lives. We'll place your orders and request the packing lives, and maybe I can bring them to you guys. I know you guys enjoy them, but how do you call it? Um, I try not to do them as often because I feel like we get bored of the same things, you know? Like today, I was like, oh, should I even go live? I wasn't really feeling it, but I was like, fuck, I have to go live. There's a little speck here. I don't know what the fuck it is. Because I wanted to remind you guys that tomorrow is our subscriber live. I don't know what this is right here. Bitch, get off. It's a little orange something, whatever. Oh, the color that I'm using right now is called um coqueta. Coqueta. Porque la Marta se siente bien coqueta. So I kind of messed up my French from trying to dig that little orange piece out, but whatever. All right, I'm going to do the ring finger also French. The, um, What? Can't wait for the Maybox. Woo. I have to definitely work on that tomorrow. So I'm thinking... That the May box is going to be um, yellow. Okay. It's going to be yellow. This brush is my size 16 Kalinsky brush. You guys can find it on the website. And for those of you guys who had been wanting the size number 12 brush, they actually came in today. So um, you guys can go get it already. Yes, this is my brush. This is my favorite brush. This one is limited. I'm not sure if we still have it in size 16, but we do have it available in size 20, I believe. So I'm going to try to bring this little, um, what is it called? This little bitch down, down, nee, 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 nee. Uh, no blue or orange. No, no blue or orange. What do you mean? On the set, I'm going to be doing orange, but on the May box, it's going to be yellow. I'm going to make it yellow. Um, So that way we could already start doing our little sunflower nails, our yellow pretty nails. Um, I believe you did yellow box already summer last year. I don't remember. I have no idea. I feel like I've done almost every damn color already. But don't worry. For those of you guys who are not participating on the monthly box, we will be having scoops in May. Um, I still haven't picked a date yet. I, I kept asking El Jefe. I was like, when should we do scoops? And he's like, never. <laughs> I'm like, um, sir, I already promised them. And he's like, I never want to do them. Um, so yeah, I still haven't, mira, el, estamos hablando del, 
Okay. That when when are we doing scoops? You're lying. Yeah. I was I was just telling them how you said never. Your swing is um ready. Oh yeah, I'm ready to hop on. E, they're gonna be like, "Excuse your swing." <laughs> you said sign inside up with the slices of beach. Ooh. All right. So meanwhile, those two dry up. I think I'm gonna do like a little marble ish situation on the middle finger. Hold on, let me fix this ring. Upside down pineapples? Yes, guys, I got a swing. But it's not the kind you guys think, okay? It. I went to Costco. Um, Wait, where's my clear acrylic? Yeah, I got myself a swing, like a chair swing for your garden. I went to Costco and I bought it there. My mom was like, oh my God, I want... Like, pretty much she would like that, right? And then I was like, don't worry, lady. I got it. I got it for us. So I'm going to do like a wannabe marble, but not really. Because I'm going to include purple and I don't want my colors to kind of touch. I don't really want them to touch because I don't know what what they're going to make. So I just want to include a little bit. Should I put white? I don't even have white in here. A little bit of marble in your life. Y la vas a usar que el swing, pues claro, amiga. Hola, that hand looks so real, yeah. Only red iguana hands look this good, honey. All right, so I'm putting a little clear in between so that they don't really mix, mix. Zule, would you ever come to Fresno or Bakersfield? Just a question. Mm, like, I'm going to go pass by it, but what... What am I coming for is the question. What do you want me to come for? To visit? All right, so I'm just putting a little bit. Not too much. Just to give it a little color, okay? Hola, Ana. Long time no see. ¿Cómo están? Ahí nomás le estoy poniendo poquito. Like, it's not really a marble, okay? It's just like little layers of color hola bienvenida i'm gonna do a ombre on here orange and purple makes a reddish brown yeah that's what i'm trying my best to not um to not let them touch because from what i remember they they don't always mix nicely you know like i'm trying to keep it springy ling ling you said you might have another class this year. Oh, yes, I did. Um, so if, if I do have another class, I think it's going to be in L.A. Damn, that's a lot of classes in one year, bitch. Who am I, honey? Yeah, so um, let me tell you guys again the colors that I'm using. So this one is Coqueta. The bright orange is called Sharon. Then it's Tropical and the glitter is Jean 19. Um, the purple is called La Dreamy, Lil Dreamy, whatever dreamy you want. I might add a little bit more purple up here, even though it might get covered, but it's okay, honey. It's okay, just a little bit, because this color is so pretty. I was going to do them all purple, but then I was like, no. Oh, thank you, goddess, MG. I was like, no, because if I do them all purple, I'm going to fall in love with them, man. And then I want them on myself. I'm just not ready to say goodbye to these yet. They're so pretty. Let me clean them. I will be there this time. I'm sad I missed the one in March. Yeah, so if you guys are interested in, in a class, it'd be towards the end of the year. So you guys could save your little cookies. Check it out. I'm not ready to say these. I'm not ready to see them go. All right, I'm also going to put some of these little flakies. These are the purple blue flakies. I'm going to add some to my napkin, like just a little bit. You guys can find them also under like the spring flakes. They're so beautiful. Oh, damn, I just spilled them. I'm going to add some with clear acrylic. I'm just going to add a few like. You can never have enough glitter, bitch. Never. Bitch, go on there, honey. Just 
just encapsulate those little mofos. Encapsulate those little hoes. Right there. All right, now I'm going to ombre them with coqueta. With a little bit of coqueta. I was going to use the color guava, but I was like, nah, let me, let me use coqueta. So in my class in March, actually, I gave my, my students, um, these colors. And at first when I taught them, I did a nail, right? Um, if you guys came to my class, you guys are probably going to remember that, but they were like orange and purple lay like that is not gonna be cute but let me tell you they loved it they came out so freaking cute and um that's i had said i want to do a set orange and purple and i just I didn't have a time well not not that i didn't have time bitch but like i forget okay I forget every time I say I'm going to do something, I get a new idea and then vale verga. So today I really didn't know what the fuck I was going to do. I had promised my lives obviously on Monday and I was like, okay, Zelene, you have to think of a design. What are you going to do for them? And while well, I was making enchiladas because that's what we made for dinner today, I was like, honey, think harder think harder and i couldn't think bitch so then i was like you know what let me look at some little screenshots that i had going on and i saw the nail of my class and i was like oh my god yes honey that's what i had said i wanted to do hi lenny stop opening the door honey can't you see it's loud today over there go Beta la verga, honey Go with your dad. Lenny's like, I don't want to go with my dad. I don't want to go. I don't want to go with my dad today, honey. Hello, um, Stephanie, como estas? The pinky? Let's see. What should I do to it? I think I'm going to do it, um, I'm going to do it orange. Fuck it, thug life. I'm going to do it a little orange. I'm going to do, yeah, I'm going to do like a dark to light orange. Oh, fuck. Where'd it go, bitch? You're eating a crap, crepe, crepe. Mmm, sounds delicious. So this color is Sharon. It reminds me of Flareon or like some hot Cheetos with cheese. Hi, Meli. Amele, Amele, Amele. How are you, senorita? Everybody is so quiet tonight. What's up? Why are you so quietness today? Hello, Sandra. ¿Cómo estás? Hola, Lola. Hola, Lola. Lola, la trailera. Hey, Zuley. Hello, Emma. Hola, Stephanie. Welcome, señoritas. Just a reminder, tomorrow is going to be our sub live. So make sure to tune in. Tomorrow, I'll try my best to be here at 6 p.m. Um, Pacific Standard Time. That's going to be our sub live, okay? And I also wanted to remind you guys um, about my giveaway. I tried to make a post earlier. I wanted, I, I was posting it here on TikTok so that my TikTok family can enter as well. But um, it went against community guidelines for some reason. Oh, fuck. I don't know if people are not allowed to do giveaways. I'm not sure, but... I had to erase it because I don't want to go to jail for something stupid. And so I'm I'm doing a giveaway on Instagram. Um, it's been available for like a week and a half already. I was going to choose a winner on the 26th, whenever the fuck that was. But then I decided to I decided to extend it until the 30th, which is tomorrow. So. If you guys wanted to participate, you guys still have um, tonight to go and follow the rules. Now you have to make sure to to read the rules because I clicked on a few people who put done in the comments and y'all were not following shit. And I was like, ma'am, you had one, you had one, 
one job. What blue acrylic did you use on the butterfly nails? Um, it I use a gel polish. I forgot the number of the gel polish, but it's a cat eye gel. Hi, Dalia. Bienvenida. ¿Cómo estás? Most of you guys didn't do it correctly, so you don't just comment. You have to post a picture on your feed and hashtag with the hashtag that I put on the post. Because when I go um live to to pick a winner, I'm going to go on the hashtag and only the posts that show there um will be entered to win. Because obviously I won't be able to see your post if you guys made one. So make sure you guys have a public profile as well if you entered. Because if it's private, I won't be able to see it. I couldn't find the post on your IG. Maybe I overlooked it. Um, go go look again later. It's it says giveaway on it. Yeah, it says giveaway, and then it has like little little eyeballs as well. Love the orange shades. I love orange. So best believe I'm about to copy this bitch. This bitch is pinky. I low key almost did. All the nails orange, but I'm like, hell nah. I want my nails to be popping. Pop, look, and drop it. Pop, look, and drop it. So, I cannot wait to take off my nails. But at the same time, I don't want to take them off because they're so beautiful. Okay, hold on. Where the fuck is my color, honey? It looks like a sunset. It looks like a sunset to you guys. But yeah, the, the giveaway is on, um, hold on, some me pinche, bitch, come over here. Sorry guys, I was picking. Oh, hi Zach, thank you for helping me with my, I don't even know what it, what it is that we were building. What, what would you call it? I was like, damn, I literally got carried today. So on Monopoly Go, Zach helped me fucking build my whole statue or whatever the fuck. I was like, damn, you didn't even let me put in work, sir. <laughs> How was Texas? It was good. Um, I would love to come back to Texas. Um, hopefully in the near future. Because I feel like I didn't really get to do much. Literally, I just went I just went and came back. I didn't really get to do much. So I'm going to go ahead and encapsulate the two nails that I have already. Before I... F oh, it's a parade flow? What? What color is the orange? So the two oranges that I used today, it's called Sharon. The one at the tip is Sharon. And the lighter one is, um, what is it called? Um, I was going to call it tangerine. It's called, um, tropical. Sorry, I had a little brain fart. But yeah, Texas was great. I really enjoyed my little time there. But you guys already know, Zule barely goes anywhere. And I literally went straight for business, which I kind of regret. But then again, I had my kids at home. So I was like, I can't stay for a long time because Lenny, Lenny was all mad at us. And Patrick was like, what is like, he didn't care that his parents were not here. But um, Lenny, oh, I tried to talk to him on the phone and he would like ignore me. I was like, sir, why are you so mad? And I was like, when I get home, he's going to for sure piss on my shit. And he did. I don't remember what he peed on, but when he mad mad, he pees on shit. Yep, it was definitely short as fuck. I feel like I stayed longer in the plane. <laughs> Imagine the bottom orange color with glow purple. Ooh, that would be fire. So the color Sharon, the bottom one, it glows in the dark. So if you guys see it, like when I applied it, it looked like marbly. It it doesn't marble. It's the the glow in the color. So that one does glow in the dark. Just in case you guys were wondering. And 
as he should. I know. I was like, sir, you pissing on my shit? Ho me? Ho me? Hi, Marta. Don't worry. Welcome. It's better uh, a little late than never. Thank you guys for joining me today. Um, I was saying that tomorrow's going to be our sub live, okay? So don't miss out. We're going to be doing some extendos tomorrow. I'm going to see if I could do some big old nails and how long it takes me. So if you guys want to watch me do some extendos, we'll be here on our sub live. And if you guys are not subscribed, you guys can... Um, you guys still got time to subscribe. Oh my god, I want to change my nails. Um, tomorrow at 6 p.m. Um, today I came on here a little late, but tomorrow I have to come on earlier because I go to work on Wednesday and I don't want to be sleepy on my way over there because on Saturday I had to drive my ass to the salon because El Jefe didn't go with me. And I was so sleepy. I was like, dude, pero quien me, quien me tiene ahí como pendeja sin dormir. Like, what the fuck? Are you changing your nails, Ule? No, not yet. I really love my nails. So I'm going to keep them for like another week, I think. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to have time to do my nails this week anyway, even if I wanted to, because... Um, I go to work this week on, on Wednesday and Friday. What's a sub live? A sub live is a private live for my subscribers. So everybody that has a little badge, um, and it says a Zeho, that means they're subscribed here on, on TikTok. So they'll be the ones that can see the live. Only. Um, hold on, there's a couple little bubbles in there. Let's see how it goes tomorrow. Tomorrow, tomorrow, I'll see you tomorrow. Zule, you have me addicted to tacos and opal. Right? Aren't they so good? And try them with that salsa too. They're fire. It's like una pobrecita snack. Or breakfast, I mean. I wait. And they even taste bomb con frijoles too. Like literal, como a little pobrecita breakfast. But pobrecita on um, point. Like fire, fire, fire. How long have you and El Jefe been together? You guys are so cute. Ah, thank you. We've been together for 12 years, going on 13 already. In June, is going to be 13 years that we've been together. Um, but we've been married for seven years. So guess what, dude? Oh, my God. <laughs> my fucking yellow nails. I win. My yellow nails are longer than the 3XL. Y como que I've been seeing them a little small. <laughs> I'm like, these are kind of little. And then I'm looking at these and I'm like, these are perfect. Dude, look at how it's like a piece. A nice little piece. Really sounds so relaxed today. <sighs> Is that a good thing? Is that a good thing? I sound relaxed. How can we enter your giveaway? Go to my Instagram. Go to my Instagram and look for the post. And um, the rules are right there. It's super easy. You just have to screenshot the picture and follow the few little rules that it says. Like literally, you just have to be, um, you just have to be following me, my Zule Nail Shop page, and the young lady that's doing the eyebrows, cause um. She just, what's her name, Mireya? She's like, Zule, can I be a part of your giveaway? And I was like, sure. So she's going to be giving away some ombre eyebrows. So if you guys are in California, you guys can win those. Um, They're going to be free. You just have to come to her spot to get them done. I would get mine. I will get mine done, but I don't really need eyebrows. I have more than enough eyebrow. All right, let me cover my monomer really quick because I'm going to file my Frenchies. Uh, you don't have to file them, but if you want it to be a little bit crisp, then 
I recommend. Oh, you had somebody help you with um <clears throat> with the giveaway entry. Super easy, guys. I haven't done a giveaway in a long time. So shout out to my little anonymous, uh, my anonymous don what is it called? Donor? What would that be? Yeah, could that be it? My anonymous donor from the monthly box and um Zule Nail Shop. Hey, with the hashtag didn't know how. Ah, super easy. Yeah, it's been um 30 minutes that I've been here. Going on 30 minutes. So we just got here. What size is the one ounce? Um, this is the one ounce. Look it. This is what a one ounce looks like. It's a nice amount. You'll have plenty for a while. Thank you, whoever is tapping. I appreciate you. Everybody else, pónganse a tapi tapi o les va a picar la cola ahorita machín, eh? Les va a ser ichi ichi el fundío por huevonas que no me andan tapi tapi. Hijas de la chinga, me van a ver, eh? Van a ver, ahorita se les va a picar el culo. Levanta la mano si te picó el culo. <risa> y no que no, no que no comen, honey. <risa> Sara, ponte a tapi tapi. Sara, tapi tapi, honey. But I'm doing my nails. Ah, ok, entonces no te va a picar el culo a ti, Janie. Nomás a los que no están haciendo nada, nomás están haciendo güey. Giselle. Ponta tapi tapi. Y one of my Frenchies came a longer than the other. Giselle Castillo. Hazle tapi tapi. O te va a picar el culo ahorita. Y no te vas a tener suficiente uña para rascarte. Eh? A mí me pica. Pero no puedo rascarme. Porque mis uñas son la. <ríe> Moon. No seas de cochina. Ráscate con una uña de mentiras. Con un swatch stick. Ando de caliente, hija de tu maíz. No anden de calientes que you are, you're going to get pregnant. I just saw a video of this girl where she glued tips with acetone. Do you think it's a good idea? No. Do not do that, guys. Do not um, dip your nail tips in acetone or monomer to glue them into your clients. Because... Um, I don't know if you guys ever paid attention, but sometimes a little smoke comes out. There's like a chemical reaction. And the last thing you want to do is, um, no dejo caliente, que dijo. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. I read things wrong. <laughs> sometimes that's what I fucking saw. And I have my glasses on today. Que dijo? En caliente, no. I'm late. I didn't get notified. Welcome, Melissa. Oh, my God. I could have sworn that's what it said. But anyway, don't try these fucking hacks that y'all be seeing on social media, okay? You don't want to burn your clients. Dije Cinderella. <sniffs> Bitch, for real? I could have sworn I saw caliente. <laughs> Ooh, that was kind of funny. Ay, Dios. I can't. I can't file this finger because of my thumbnails getting in the way. Like, ma'am. Okay, I guess we're not gonna nada que ver. Como dicen, mm, como dicen mi mom? What the fuck is it that she says? Something like when you invent shit. I can't remember her stupid saying that she would tell us. I'm dead. You're hilarious, dude. I used nail glue to seal a embroidery string once and it started smoking. Yeah, I got scared. Yeah, because um, glue, glue and other things make chemical reactions. Another hack that's a no-no is gel in monomer. Exactly. Like a lot of people think they're so smart. I include it, okay, because I did it in the past. 
um, where we're so smart and we're saving money by making a new color with our gel and our monomer. Do not do that. Please do not do that. And do not put nail polish and acetone in your airbrush machines either. El sordo no escucha, pero bien que le compone. Ándale, algo así. Ajá. It goes something like that. Tú como que eres comadre de mi mom, porque tú te las sabes todas, Ma Mayra. All right, so for my two Frenchies, I'm going to go ahead and use la Dreamy, Lil Dreamy. Yeah, just screenshot it and post it to your page. El sordo no oye, pero bien compone. Ándale, sí, ustedes sí saben, sí, son bien paisas, igual que mi mamá. Where's my comadre? Uh, she's in her room somewhere. All right, so I'm going to put a little bit of pop -o. This color is um, la dreamy. Wait, this whole time I thought you were Asian. What? What do you mean, honey? Because I say, honey, honey, relax. Relax, honey, honey. Okay, got it. Yeah. I spilled nail glue and tried to wipe it with chloro wipes and started smoking. What in the world would... Marlene, no, guys. Anything with cotton? If you guys do anything with any type of cotton or whatever, there will be a reaction with glue. So don't ever spill it on your clothes either because that shit will burn. And I'm telling you guys from experience. I spilled some on my pants once. <gasps> Dude, that shit fucking started like sizzling almost. Yeah, I was like, what the fuck? And they do that. So don't use cotton balls. Don't use a napkin to clean up your glue because it will get hot and um, it will burn, okay? Just don't drop your glue. Hey, put a little seatbelt on it. Put a little seatbelt on that bitch. Uh, I'm going to make something to like... Para que no se nos caiga el glue. Bro, one time I got some on my pants and I got stuck to my skin. Yes, dude. Any type of glue, any type of glue, for the most part, will do that. Nail glue, bling adhesive, glue glue, whatever type of glue just does not go well with cotton or, like, fabric. Um, me, I'm barely gonna notify. Easy, ¿por qué? El TikTok no te quiere, honey. All right, let me open up my other colors real quick. A little bit of Monica. All right, I'm gonna put a little orange. I'm gonna put a little orange here. Hello, Leslie. Welcome. I'm gonna put a little bit of orange in here. A little bit of flitter. I think I'm gonna do these a little clear ish. What do you guys think? Just like. I got my package today. <sighs> Woohoo! Oh, you know what I forgot to ask? I think. Yeah, so for party. Oh, well. Oh, well. Okay, I'm going to do this one half and half. Half purple, half blue. I mean, half purple and half orange. Hello, how much for those nails? These are not for sale. I'm at work and I was driving earlier. Ooh, where where do you work at, Jessica? Where do you work at, honey? I got my package. Damn, everybody getting their package today. Woohoo, woohoo. Thank you everybody for shopping at Zule's Nails .com. We appreciate you guys. I think you need more of the glow in the dark orange to balance it. A little bit of orange. You guys just like that color, huh? You like, you like, honey. I get mine on Wednesday. Let me go see where my package at. Now you guys are going to go make Myra track her shit. Like, where is my shit? I work at the local homeless shelter. Ooh. 
cool. Yes, I do my own nails. You do your own nails. Yes, yes, yes. I wish I had somebody to do my nails, but then at the same time, no, because I low-key enjoy doing my nails. All right. I'm going to add a little bit more orange then. Since you, you want me to add more Sharon. Sharon. Okay, I'm add a little bit of both of the, the, the orange here. I'm going to do a little bit of, damn, you do it fire. Thank you. I love nails. That's why. I love nails. I love everything to do with nails. I'm a nail addict. Thanks. Uh, what, from one nail addict to another. Just a little bit. Zule, when would you do bling scoops? Oh, thank you for asking. I'm going to be doing um scoops of everything on this upcoming month. So I'm going to have acrylic scoops, gel scoops, and bling scoops. Okay? How long you take doing your own nails? I take about three to four hours. It just depends on the design so sometimes sometimes i could take three hours sometimes i could take longer it just depends like if i'm doing french that should take me forever if i'm painting anything it takes forever all right i'm gonna add some glitter excuse me i'm add some little flakies why the fuck are they not wanting to come to mama man what the hell? They don't want to come to mama. What size brush is your favorite? My ultimate favorite is the size um 16, which is the one that I'm doing right now. And sometimes she'd be fast as fuck, boy. <laughs> For real, man. The other day I was like, Daintily, you actually a little fish today. Alright, let me get some more flakies because my dumbass um my dumbass spilled them. Just a little bit. That was creepy. What was creepy? It, yes, the size 12 is back in stock. I want to say I added them to the website already. They came in earlier today. So I'm going to add a little bit of flitter. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. Which brush is your favorite? My my number 16 brush. This one that I'm using um, is number 16. But we carry it in pink. Pink and unicorn. And to be honest, it just depends. Sometimes I like the number 20 when it's a little hot. Do you have a pedicure on yourself? Yes, I do. Do you want to see it? Hey, just kidding. No free shows here. The fuck? There ain't no free shows. Hi, Samantha. Como estas? No free shows here. You want to see my feet? You got to pay me. And it is a lion. If you want to see my toes, you're going to send me a lion. Okay, not the baby one, the big one. Yeah, we have size 20, size 24. I think size 24 is the largest. So I'm just encapsulating my little glitter a little bit because I'm going to file my French just a tad bit. Isule, do you think you're going to do the scoops? Yes. Oh, when? Um, I think the second week of the month. What purple color are you using? I'm using La Dreamy. La Dreamy, Lil Dreamy from the Gangsta Collection. So I'm not fully encapsulating yet. I'm just encapsulating a little bit. So when I file, um, I don't get into my glitter, okay? I walked away to check if I have the 12. I eat some of you. Same of you. What is scoops? So pretty much scoops is like a little sale that we do um, on live. You guys buy them in advance and then we um, scoop them up live. So, um, I throw a bunch of acrylics in a bin or gel or bling, whatever it is, the scoop that you're buying. 
um, I mix them up with other colors and then we sell it by the scoop. I use a little pan or a little scoopy scoop. And then whatever comes out is yours. I walked away to check if you have the 12 and you're wanting a line for feet pics. <laughs> yeah, it's because somebody said if I have a pedicure right now. So, you know, they want to see it ain't going to be free. It's going to have to be um paid with a lion. My husband asked, why am I getting more bling scoops when I have a lot? Hey, 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 hey honey. It's because we're bedazzlers, okay? Look, did you guys see my purse already? Look, guys, it's so pretty. I love it. Look, this is what you guys could do with your bling scoops. You guys could do purse. You could do hat. You could do hat. You could do cup. You could do... But dazzle your your um lamp. You could but dazzle, uh, but dazzle everything. You could even but dazzle phone case or iPad, whatever you have. I but dazzle everything and anything. So that's why we need more bling, hubby. Because we're bling queens, okay? I bling my Darth Vader ears too. Oh, yeah, honey. Hasta los calzones. Andale. All right, guys. I'm going to file a little bit of my Frenchie. Let me get my little drill. Did I tell you guys that I fucking dropped my drill? I dropped my drill and I don't know how to take the little piece off now, man. The little piece is stuck in there. Does anybody know? Does anybody know how to take out the little piece? I already tried shaking it and everything. Y nada. I feel like it makes a little bit more vibrations, but maybe I'm tripping. Oh, with a magnet. You guys are so smart. I'm going to try it right now. All right. I'm just filing the little Frenchie so it's not too thick there. And I feel like sometimes when I file here, um, it makes it more crisp. But I'm not sure. Maybe I'm tripping. All right, hold on. Let me file this little bitch. All right, hold on. Let me try the magnet. Let's see if it comes out. It's not working. It's not working, guys. Hmm. It doesn't want to come. Nope. Hopefully it's not aluminum because a magnet won't work for it. I'm not sure if... If it is a magnet... No, it does. It does, um... Look, so this one does get stuck to it, but I think it's too deep. My, my extra coarse fucking bit broke in there. Look, don't drop your bits, guys, because this shit just literally fell. Maybe I should put glue. Y vali pura verga. Zule, tomorrow when you go live, will you use a number eight brush? Hell no. Tomorrow I'm gonna do um I'm gonna do extendos. You want me to to use a number eight brush? I'm never gonna be done. Honey. I'ma do some extendo nails. Thank you for the galaxy, Jessica. Thank you very much. How about that galaxy? Woo! That is not a toe. 
But I'll show you something else. What do you want to see? <laughs> I Well, you need a lion, Jessica. Do we get feet? No, Lori. Um, it's because earlier somebody was asking me if I had a pedicure done. And I was like, yes, I do. But that's going to be a lion for a pedicure. What glue you use for big crystals? I use my glue, the Zule Bling Adhesive and the Cluster Gel. All right, let me whip my little brush real quick. I mean, my little nail to get it. Un shout out. I'm going to shout out. All right, let's encapsulate this bitch. Yeah, so tomorrow at 6 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, um, is gonna be our next Z Ho live tomorrow. So put an alarm ready so you guys don't miss it. We're gonna do some extendos, some extendo nail. Um, for those of you guys who are new here, um, the glue that I use is from my website. I have two of them. For the super, super giant big ones, I use the cluster gel, which is a glue gel. Look at this one. This one. And then um, for the flat packs, I use the Zule Bling Adhesive. I think I'm going to do some 3D flowers. I haven't done those in a while, huh, Zule? Lori want me to cheat with her. I told her no. <gasps> Lori. I'm going to give you pow pow. I'm gonna give you pow pow with a with a stick, eh? With a meter stick. <laughs> so even if you try to run, I will get you. I will get you, honey. Oh my god! Why well, I thought this was a real hand? Because it's so good, honey. Super Gucci. I I wanna do nail forms, but I don't have a model. I don't have a model, honey. Ooh, that sounds like fun. Maybe I take the pow pow. Eee! Lori. No, you're not supposed to want it. Zule, is that Manuela La Guada? I don't remember if this is Manuela or Marta. But she is kind of loosey goosey, huh? I prefer this one than the stiff one now. Not gonna lie. Back in the day, I used to prefer the stiff one. But now I like it. I kind of like it. All right, I'm going to add a little bit more here. A little bit more. Right there, right there, right there. These are definitely colors that I would never think to match together. <sighs> My back is itchy. All right, let me do the ring finger. Thank you, whoever is tapping. I see my little likes growing. Thank you very much. El Jefe earlier was using the massager on his hand. I guess he was like kind of sore or whatever. And he was like, he was like, look, I could go give you likes on your live. I'm like, si, sí, pero no tienes TikTok, honey. No tienes TikTok. Come on, más the likes. ¿Y qué pasa con la Felicia? I don't remember which one is Felicia. I forgot which, which one's Felicia was, was the hand with the knuckles. I don't remember them. I don't remember my hands names because I stopped using them for a while. So the orange colors, just in case you guys are wondering, is Tropical and um sharon i want to use sharon on my nails in the near future so if i ever forget remind me please you lay your drill can what oh i could take the piece out how maribel marisbel oh sorry i can't i some of you fast your products help me 200 percent. i'm the one who takes you with the bling no live anymore woohoo you lay your drill you can remove the top oh really how? Hello, Diamond Queen. What's the name of the one hand that has thrown hands? Um, I don't remember. I'm going to have to go back and look at my posts. Because I don't remember her name. I was going to say Karen, but I don't think I have a Karen one. Where did you get your hand? It is 
Um, it's from RedIguana.com. You guys can find them if you go to Google. Put RedIguana.com. Knuckles. Kevin! Kevin! All oh, the nails of the minions. They're so cute. I know. Um... I just been lagging to do those because one motherfucking minion took me a long time to create. Like the 3D little figures, they do take some time to um to mold. Let's see. If I have some 3D gels, maybe I could do, twist the hand like your ma'am. <laughs> You funny, honey. You funny. Twist it. Pop it. Pull it. My coworkers. Ah, oh, Zule. Por andar chismosa. Fuck. Hold on, guys. This is why I should not skip fingers and do them all at the same fucking time. Lord. Uh, my coworkers are jealous of my nails, but rather pay 200 somewhere else. You know what? And that's the sad fucking truth. Our coworkers, our cousins, family, friends, they will never want to pay you what you charge, but will gladly go and pay full price somewhere else. I just don't understand. I don't understand why they're like that, but just know that um, it happens and you're not missing out on much. Cause let me tell you, um, you don't want to mix business with family and friends. That's why I always say in business, there's no friends or family because they always want it cheaper. They always pick your shit. They always want to be extra special. So you just, you shouldn't even care. Just be like, bitch, this could have been you, but you playing. You fucking playing. And, um, yeah, that's just the sad fucking truth. They're always gonna fucking pay someone else, but not you. And I don't, I don't know why. Exactly. Mm-hmm. Yup. And you know what? A lot other people will appreciate your work way more than them. So don't even ever feel bad if you guys see your prima or your best friend go somewhere else. They're not really your friends if they're not supporting your business like that. But sometimes it's best to keep them away. Keep them away because they just don't understand, period. If they even support you at all, my family just came around. Mm -hmm. I stopped talking to friends and family about business. Yeah, like most of the time they just want it free, you know. And you can't blame them because if they had a business, you'd kind of want it free too. So don't even feel no type of bad. Yep, keep it separate so you don't have a fallout. Uh huh, because um, it never fails that somebody gets mad and then you have no more friends. All right, hold on, guys. Let me wait for my shit to dry. Let me find a little file now. <clears throat> so at work, I've been filing the shit out of my bling. Look at oh, when I hold the finger, it goes. <laughs> So sad. All right, let's see. I have in two minutes. My is gonna be one hour. Yes, the box for May is gonna be yellow. I'll show it to you guys tomorrow. I'll work on it tomorrow. Um, all of the older adults in my family all say your nails are pretty, but I wish you didn't wear. What the hell? I'll be like shit. I wish you would shut up and tell them that. That's rude AF. But you know what? I was watching, um, well, I was listening to a podcast yesterday. Mm. I was watching a podcast of Snow the Product. No, wait, was it?
Yeah, it was her. Was it yesterday? Yeah, it was. When I was bedazzling my hat, I was listening to a podcast she had with, I don't know who. And she was talking about how um, her family didn't. Um, her family didn't, um, uh, accept her or whatever until she made it. Um, she didn't have to come out of the closet or anything like that because she like, I don't know how to explain it without going to jail here. You know, I don't want to go to jail, but, um, it was crazy. And I was like, that is so crazy. Cause somebody was asking her like, Oh, what age did you come out? Or da, 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 da. And then, um, she was pretty much saying that she didn't really have to come out and she didn't really care if her family accepted her or not. Because once she made money, like, cause she's a rapper, once she made enough money, they pretty much accepted her. And that's the sad thing, unfortunately, for a lot of people. Like, when you guys are self-employed or you do whatever it is that makes you happy, unless you make, like, hella fucking money, they, they'll fucking still judge you until you can shut their ass, shut their fucking mouth. Then they'll continue to be like, oh, I wish you didn't. But she, I bet you if you had hella fucking money, they wouldn't say shit, you know? And that's the sad thing. It's like, dude, why does it have to take somebody to make hella money or to be famous or whatever to be accepted? Like, that's fucked up. And I was like, damn, that's crazy. But it's so fucking true. Same with hair. I offered 60 and paid 180 elsewhere. So I'm not very good at explaining things, but I'm like, I don't really want to go into detail about what she was talking about because it doesn't really go with what we're talking about. But my point was that I remember back then when I was a beginner doing nails, how to call it, my family would always be like, that's not a real job. Or they'll tell me like, I wish you had a real job, a real career or whatever the fuck. But now that they finally see like, damn, it does make money. Does it, 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 it. Now they're like, okay, like that's my cousin. Like, fuck you, bitch. Where were you when I was doing crooked fucking flowers or whatever? Like when you didn't believe in me, honey. Exactly, because if I started taking clients and making money, most of them will shut. Yes, and you will fucking shut them the fuck up. Trust me. Hey, maybe this is your sign, Mason. You better start taking some clients to shut them up. Hey, they're going to be like, that's that's my son. That's my, my cousin or whatever. You're in your husband's account. And it is always like that. So don't ever feel bad, okay? If people don't acknowledge your work or whatever, like, one day it will happen. Girl, I believe in you since I started getting cosmetology class. Oh, honey. Are the crystals on your nails the same as one? Oh, yes, yes. These are the ones on my website. Yeah, there's a lot of people who fucking didn't. They'll be like, like the one thing that I'm glad I've always been like a little rebel that I didn't listen, listen to what they told me. I was like, nope. I'm going through that right now. I'm friends that would talk shit about my nails in the beginning. Yep, it's, it's more common than you think. A lot of people are going to talk shit. A lot of people are going to make faces at you. Like, esta pendeja, quien se cree? Quien se cree cobrando eso? Queriendo cobrarme 20 dólares? Like, earlier, I was on threads. um, And this chick was like, I love my nail tick, but... um. Hold on, let me throw away my chicle. It's making my mouth too watery. Um, 
she was like i love my nail tech and everything but i feel like she overcharged me and did the sloppiest job ever or something like that and i was like what the fuck so i go and i comment obviously she got chrome nails with and french so i, I commented because the messy part was the chrome on her fingers which is gonna come off when she washes her hands but i was like hell no nah, let me go let me go um let me go comment and be like girl well you did ask for the two most annoying things right most annoying and difficult things chrome number one is not the easiest to work with and number two you got french on top of that honey because she was like and it, she pretty much she was saying that her nail tech raised her prices without even telling her and i was like well girl you did get chrome and you did get frenchy so i'm sure you probably just get basic ass nails so it's not that she raised her prices it's just you got two shit two add-ons or whatever oh shit the Okay, guys, the puzzle has come. There you go. All right, so I was like, hey, now let me go. Let me go fucking. I have bills, too, so I was trying to help both of us. I thought the hand was real. I posted my YouTube info asking my family to subscribe, but only a few of them did. Lola, um, you don't want your family to subscribe just to give you numbers. Just don't even tell them. What you want is people to subscribe little by little and to actually watch your channel because this is something that I learned over time. Um, if you don't want a lot of numbers. You want people who actually fuck with you, you know? So if you tell your family, oh, subscribe, subscribe, do this, do that. They're not going to watch your videos and then they're going to feel more. You're going to feel more sad that you have people as subscribers, but they're not really watching or nothing like that. Right. So mejor just keep posting and let strangers be your supporters. Because our family just not gonna they're not gonna support like that. And if they do, they're just probably going to judge your ass. Quality over quantity. Yeah. Yeah. Putting that on my wall. Yeah, it has to be their thing. If not, they're not going to support. Like back then, my... My mistake, my mistake in the past was trying to give things away to people on my channel, on my YouTube channel in the beginning it's for them to subscribe. I do giveaways or whatever, but I wasn't really attracting people who were going to watch my channel. It was just because i wanted to get more followers right but sometimes it's not even about having a lot of followers it's by having people who actually like the content be there you know so don't focus too much on that are your nails heavy i love them um i don't think they're heavy they don't feel heavy So I stopped doing that because I'm like, fuck that. I don't want people to follow me just because they're trying to win a giveaway or they're trying to win something or whatever the fuck. Like, I want people to follow me because they like what they see or whatever, you know? Like, if I could erase half of my followers on Instagram, like if I could pick and choose people who don't interact with my shit, I would. Because what's the point of having so many followers if they don't even interact? That's why in the street, I don't really like to give people my Instagram no more. Because it's like, why are you going to follow me? You don't even like my shit. <laughs> you, you don't even like my shit, bitch. You're just following me to be nosy. I could? How? Yeah, I'm going to be back tomorrow, guys, for our sub-only live. 
So I'll be back tomorrow at 6 p.m. for our sub only live. I watch your YouTube faithfully every time my hubby hears your voice. He said, Oh my gosh. You're going to hey, remove followers. There's a section on IG. <gasps> Can you show me? Hola, Meli. ¿Cómo estás? Show me. How can I do that? I'm like, I don't want some ghost ass followers that act like ghosts, actually. Just spying or whatever. Because bitches be looking at my stories, but never in my views. Or however that audio goes. I see them in my stories, but I never see them in my comments. No, I will get deleted. I have a bad habit of saying that it's cute, but never actually tap. Go to your followers and see least interacted. Oh, but is that like I least interacted with them or they least interacted with me? My nails took me six and a half hours. Okay, girl. That's not bad. They came out great. Good night. Buenas noches. Like, it's so funny when I go to a store and they'll be like, oh, my God, let me see your nails. And then, how to call it, um, they'll be like, do you do nails over here? And I'm like, um, no, they'll be like, do you have an Instagram? And then I'm like, yeah, I do. And then I tell them straight up, like, oh, but I work in Los Angeles. And they're like, oh, never mind then. <laughs> I'm like, okay. Okay, honey, bye. I was like, I don't, I don't want you to be a ghost follower, honey, because you're not going to get an appointment. I'm not sure, but I take notes of who's looking and not engaging. Girl, I'm going to need somebody to take notes for me. Like, who the fuck is not engaging with my shit? Be like, if y'all are looking at my stories, but y'all never in my likes or my comments, y'all gonna get deleted, bitch. <laughs> Don't be looking at my fucking stories, you hoe. You're not gonna interact with my shit. Is my next audio. I'm not sure. Oh, okay, child, that finger is flexing. Yeah. My crystals always fall off. What do you use? I use the Zule Cluster Gel. You can find it on my website. The link is on the bio. So my drill is not at its full potential because it has a piece stuck in there. I can't look or I'm going to get up in my feelings. Where are you going to look at? Do you send to Mexico? No, we don't. So I put a smaller nail tip on this one. That's why it looks skinnier. Just in case you guys wondered, I put it the same nail tip. Number five, number five. Sounds like a bird. Yeah, it's, it's fucking up with my filing over here. I'm like, what the hell? There's a little piece in there stuck. Oh, I feel like there's something in my esophagus stuck right there, man. Oh, yeah. So what were we talking about? I already forgot, man. I already forgot. So just a reminder, tomorrow is our um, sub live. Oh, no, I haven't gave a date for scoops. I'll give it to you guys tomorrow in our sub live. I haven't made it yet, but I'll give it to you guys tomorrow. But I've been so bad lately that I need to suck it up. No, not you, Lori. We're talking about those people that just look at your shit but don't like because they're like low-key haters. Like, I don't know, actually. I don't understand. It's like there's some people like I want to say some of my clients be doing that shit to other people. So maybe that's why I know. Like they'll be like, oh, yeah, I'm looking at that. And then. They're like, oh, but I don't want to touch it because then they're going to know I was watching. Like, bitch, what do you mean? Then you shouldn't fucking be watching them if you're not going to give them a like. Because 
trust me, I've I've had clients that are like that, looking at other people, but they won't interact with their shit because they don't want them to know they're watching. But it's like, okay, then why are you watching? Then why are you watching them if you don't like them, huh? So that's where I get my ideas from because I've seen it firsthand with my clients. Or they'll be like, can you follow this person so I can look at their stuff? And I'm like, what the fuck? That's weird as shit, honey. You follow them. No, it's because I don't want them to know I'm looking. I'm like, okay. So how often do you do sub lives? I want to subscribe. I do them once a month at the end of the month. Imagine if every person who watches just liked it. Oh, that would be amazing. That would be amazing. But you know what? Who was it that was talking about this today? Um, some girl comment made it made a a post earlier today on um, threads. She goes like Instagram is dying because. Um, people with I don't know how many li views or followers or whatever get like 200 likes and I'm like girl my 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 Instagram must be dead for a long time then because my my views and my likes don't add up but it's because people are just used to like scrolling so sometimes it's not even that they're being haters they're just scrolling a little too fast they didn't they didn't have little breaks or something like some people just don't like anything period and there's nothing bad about it you know like in their head they're not really being like oh fuck this bitch i'm not gonna give her a like it's just they don't remember so they try to twist off the top of the chrome of the drill oh okay hold on oh fuck Hold on, guys. Hold on. Let's check. Hello, Ito. in there what the fuck it's n I don't see it I think it's stuck in there oh now use the magnet I'm going uh, to take it all apart, and then I'm not going to be able to put it back. <laughs> it doesn't work. I don't know what happened. Yeah, I don't know. Little by little, it'll come off, I think. Oh, shit. All right, let's see if anything happened. Can I have to do that kind of stuff? I don't know. Imagine the piece is not even in there. <laughs> ay, que tonta soy. Ay, ay, ay. Come on, bitch. Fuck. <laughs> That's funny, Myra, but it's true. He would say something like that. Like, sir, get out of here. Okay. That's enough filing for me today. I don't want to do no more filing with the drill. Because then I remember there's something stuck in there. All right, let me snatch these up because these fingers are not looking even Steven. 
Too late. You know how to pay for that man over time. Girl. I do. But I don't want to pay over time. <laughs> I'm like, sorry. Tú me vas a seguir debiendo. All right. Let's see. Let's see, honey. Oh, yeah, I don't know if I have, like, anxiety or what, but my, I have, like, chest pain, kind of. I don't know how to explain it. Something's wrong here. All right. Clickety-click, the bad bitch is back. All right, Felicia, Marta, whatever your name is. Those nails on of your butterflies. You lie, honey, you lie. The full video is up on my YouTube channel just in case you guys missed it. Um, I posted them up already. I posted them. I even posted my mom's up already. Oh my god, me too. But I took my meds, so not really. Wonder if it is anxiety. I don't know how what does anxiety feel like to like I just feel like I have something stuck in my chest like like I can't breathe ish like like you know I don't know how to explain it but why would I have anxiety gas tampoco was the lighter shade of blue it's a, oh, this one, it's a painting gel. That's what it feels like. Check your blood pressure. I don't have a machine. My fake hand is giving me anxiety here. Take an allergy pill. What color we use today? So the nude color is called Coqueta. The light orange is called um, Tropical. And the other one is called Sharon. Zule, what adhesive do you recommend for the colorful bling pack? Colorful bling pack. I'm not sure which one is that. Oh, the bling adhesive. It's um more of a preference. Like if you want to control when your glue dries, um, I recommend the cluster gel. If you guys like your shit to dry fast as fuck, then the bling adhesive. But both of them are bomb. They both work amazing. <sighs> Zule, I got an evil eye watch band for my Apple Watch. Ooh, how cool. So next time I will put the next size up because that one is looking a little skinny. What color do you guys think I should do my flowers? Purple or orange? I'm going to do some flowers. But I don't know if I should do them purple or orange. What do you guys think? Is a cluster gel air dry? No, that one dries in the lamp. Both? <sighs> both, 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 senora. Oh my god, I didn't even tell you guys. So I went to Costco, right? And one of my followers' mom, shout out to her. She's watching. I don't know if she's here. I don't even I didn't even get her name. Um, but she caught me when I was recording my mom at Costco when she was um grabbing her pills or whatever it was that she was grabbing. The thing that I posted, and then later on they're like, and then I recognized her from the pop-up from my first pop-up ever she came with her boyfriend and then she was like oh my mom my mom recognized you or whatever and i thought that was kind of cute and i was like oh i feel like a little a little famous niche how long did it take you to do a set like the set you're doing now it takes me two three to four hours so far i've been here for an hour and 24 minutes
fighting with a stupid hand takes me a little bit longer. But if I do it on myself, it's it's about the same. I'm not even gonna play around. I took a long time. Period. Going to redo my hand keychain. Yes, honey. I've been wanting to do a little keychain again. I feel like this nail's crooked. The I filed it crooked, but oh well. Oh well, La Marta, she can't even see. She's blind. Zule, do one finger with orange flowers, the other with purple. We'll see right now. I guess it depends where I put the flowers, huh? Not me thinking this was a real person. It is a real person. Her name is Marta. I can see it in my head. Do you ever hit your nails when doing stuff around the house? Because I hit my nail and it popped off. Yes, I do hit them, but it's very rare. I was actually looking at pictures of my nails, how fucked up they used to be about a year or two ago. I was like, oh my God. I thank the Lord I haven't lost a nail bed. I have not lost a nail bed in a long time. Under the sea. Under the sea. So the only bad thing about having bling on the index finger is that you file it. So just FYI, if you guys are going to wear bling there or your thumbs, just know if you're going to be working doing nails, it will get fucked up quickly. Okay. <sighs> okay. All right, hold on, guys. I'm getting some little alcohol in my brush. Woo! They look so beautiful. Look at them. Look at it. Wow. So pretty. So pretty. All right. I think I'm going to do so bomb. You lie. You lie, honey. I think I'm going to do like little roses. I'm going to put, um, I'm going to put white in the flowers. Cause you know, you can't have flowers without white. I'll do white, orange, and maybe white and purple. Right? Don't they look so fucking cute? Should I take a picture of them just like... Um, with a... Hey, where's the ring go? Who stole my ring, bitch? Oh my god, I always forget it's not a real hand. It's a real... A real hand. Right now, I'm gonna fuck with you guys even more. I'm gonna put her a jacket. Hold on. Her name is Marta, okay? And she is a real, a real customer. There. There, my customer is more real now, huh? Oh, here is one of the rings. All right, I'm going to put some flores on her. This one is called um Isabella or some shit like that. I don't forgot her name. I want one of the tattooed hands. There. Ahora sí. Ya se armó, Martas. All right, let me get my monoma with some acetone. Doesn't it look real as shit now? Let me put the button. Don't be jelly, honey. All right, where's my acetone at? Who stole my acetone? I like to put acetone in my monomer. You remind me of your grandma? Damn, your grandma must be fucking bomb, huh? 
yo grandma you know what i'm gonna i'm gonna put top coat on this shit because it looks fire just by themselves huh what do you guys think should i put top coat now or later <laughs> i don't remember what i said now all right let's put top coat now and then we'll put the bling, the flores on top. All right, I'm gonna use the late top coat. Let's zoom in. Those are cute for all my little basic hoes. Um, this will look fire just like that. I don't know why, but I got a little stuffy. All right, let's put on the top coat. Let's do matte. Ah, nail. Ahorita no. Maybe next time. Can't you see we have all the glitters? We have all the glitter in here when it's shiny. Clienta, don't touch. Please stop scratching your face. Then you're going to be like, why my shiny top coat come off? Hola, niece. Zule, why is it okay to mix acetone and monomer? I'm going to do 3D flowers. That's why. Um, so the, the acetone speeds up the dry time of the acrylic. So when doing 3D flowers, you can add a few drops of acetone to your monomer. So it could dry a little bit faster. Um, yes, I use a dust collector. So look it. I use a dust collector all the time for the most part at the salon. Sometimes here at home. Oh, yeah, I'm so stupid, guys. Hold on. So look it. I don't know if you guys could see the little manchitas on the index finger. Do you guys see the little separation? Did I touch it? Or is it that the nail's um oily or something? Did somebody watch me touch it? Did I touch that part? Oh yeah, I keep touching it with the nails. <sighs> Alright, hold on. Let me cure two nails at a time. So normally that happens when the nails are not clean, right? If the nails aren't clean, that will happen. But I just clean them with alcohol, so that shouldn't. Um, I cleaned it with the brush. Did you guys go somewhere? We were outside in the fire. In the fire? In the fire pit. Oh, you turned it on? In the game. Oh, with the little swing? The liquid lost. <laughs> They're eliminated. <laughs> Losers. I use the brush. I don't have toe separators, but I use the brush to to do the alcohol. Oh yeah. So I guess don't use the brush because I see it right there. Don't be lazy like me. I use the brush with the alcohol. So that normally happens when the nail is not 100% clean. So let me have, let me fucking clean it the right way with a fucking lint free wipe, bitch. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, the brush probably had something on there, huh? Like I probably didn't brush. Maybe I just wet them, but I didn't brush them all. I did it kind of fast. El Jefe is not going to come right now that much because his brother's here. My cuñiz. My cuñiz is here. How do I clean and restore my brush? My niece gave me a Zule brush, but she had used it before. Um, I clean my brushes just with monomer. With its own little monomer. All right, so let me just put some comb. That 
orange is fucking fire though. So the bad thing about these wiggly hands is um they touch each other too much. Like bitch, can you fucking stop touching the other finger? Honey, can es mi culito? Can can my my brother in law, you met him before. His bro. His bro. All right, so don't put too much top coat because then it's going to run on the sides. Dedo sucio, sí. Yo creo que se rascó la cola, la pendeja. Y se tocó. All right, let me cure those two. At least, like, that purple and orange together is so cute. Never would have thought to put them together, right? Sometimes you just have to experiment with your colors. Because, like I was saying, I, I gave my students these colors for my class in March. I gave them purple. I gave them orange. And um, coqueta, white. I think those are the colors we had. And what well, we had to use what we had for practice. And then little did we know, they came out cute as shit. Woohoo, Emma, what you get, girlfriend? It's a love and hate when I see you using product. What you mean, Ruthie? Do you get sadness? Because I could use it on myself. I love Coqueta. Me too. If you guys haven't got that color, you guys are playing. All right. Let me top coat these again because the little piece. The little piece playing. I want to do myself yellow nails again. I haven't even taken off my yellow nails and I want them again. I want yellow nail again, honey. Um, tengo sueño, Marta. Tengo sueño. Me vas a pegar el sueño. Yeah, girl, because I ate doing nails for the views. It's like a waste of product. Oh, <laughs> Actually, it's not a waste of product because you are practicing. You are practicing. So there's no such thing as um, wasting product. You just have to look at it a different way. You are getting practice on. You're practicing a new set. So use your product because if you don't use it, you lose it. You know, like it could go bad while it's just sitting in your shelf and stuff, you know. So don't ever think that you guys are just wasting it. Hi, Sue. How are you? You look good in yellow. Ooh, thank you. Fuck my life. Ya me dio sueño, but then I get a chicle and luego I, my mouth gets too watery and then I'm like. Do you know why top coat clumps up at the top after? Oh, like in the rim? It, if it leaks and it dries there, that's why. Literally just saying this when I was considering practicing. Yes, will you be having another class in your in the future? Um... I do hope to have another class at the end of the year. Um, but I'm not sure if it's going to be in Yucaipan or in LA. Where are you from, Melissa? Let me put it a little bit one more time. Do you do Mimi's nails often? I love, I love to meet her. Um, I do the puerta, but... Hi, Koreiki. Koreik, C-R-A-K-A, baby. Are you a licensed instructor? I am a licensed manicurist. I don't know what it takes to be a licensed instructor. Um, like, I don't have a school, but I have a nail license. Tengo la licencia de Dios. All right, hold on. Let me take a quick little video of these basics before I add the flowers.
Okay. I'm from Yukaipa. I wanted to attend so bad, but girl, my back account was thinking otherwise. Oh, <laughs> you're so funny. But don't worry. If we have another one, it'll be towards the end of the year. I'll let you guys know soon. I'm like, all right. I'm going to use a color white. Damn, them bank accounts trying to tell us what to do. They so pushy. <laughs> yeah, sometimes, pues, no se puede, ¿verdad? But I'm hoping. I think I'm going to use the dark orange. I don't think I've done flowers. You know what? What if I do them? Nah, I'm going to do them like that. All right, I'm going to put it on the ring finger. I feel like that one needs, like, a floor. Mm, what are they asking? Are allowed to offer nail certification classes. Who? What? When? Where? Why? Ah, fuck. I scrolled away. All right. I'm going to do some florecitas. I'm going to do like a little rose or something. A rose. I just had a few questions about boards. About boards? State board, you mean? Yes, this is a real client. Her name is Marta. She's just kind of shy. We had to give her time to... um. Damn, this shit's drying fast as fuck, boy. Someone asked if you're a licensed instructor, and I said usually licensed nail techs are allowed to offer. Oh, okay, okay. You're going to break her fingers. It's okay. She likes to be broken. She likes to be broken, heartbroken, especially. Eh? She has, um, what is it called when your joints just like do whatever, whatever you want? <laughs> All right. So today I'm going to try to see if I can invent like a flower or something. Like I don't want to do a rose, but something along those lines. She double jointed. Uh huh. Yeah. I dislocated her fucking finger, her arm, her elbow, everything. Is it because, oh fuck. Muzzles. <laughs> So the acetone is definitely doing his job here. Zoo, you haven't talked to me today. What do you mean? I This is the first comment I see from you, honey. Where you been at, girlfriend? Que no ves que las andaba regañando hace rato? I was like, no anden de pinches quiets. Oh, thank you for the lemonade, honey. You know, I always regañando everybody. Zule, I lost my pinky finger. What? Um, what? What do you mean? Let me get my water. Hydration. Oi. Dude, I'm gonna fucking hate this hand, I swear. Zule has everything she needs to do and whatever her license and social media. Yeah, I don't know what they saying, but whatever they said. Okay. ¿Qué color es? Um, I'm using white and Sharon. So if you guys like bright nail better for you, then you guys will like Sharon. This this 3D brush is my number six. Uh-huh. Yeah, look at Hi, Sharon. We're using your color today. Ooh. Ooh, thank you for the slippers. Where did I leave the purple one at? Oh, here it is. Zule, honey, any updates on the scoops? Um, Yes. I'm going to give you guys a day tomorrow. It's going to be on the first half of the month. I'll probably do them 
um, on the week of the 15 inch, okay? No, more tornadoes. Those are scary, man. Yeah, so if you guys have been wanting to participate in scoops, um, you guys could save your little shmoney. So we're going to have them the second week, most likely, of May. Um, what day I haven't picked yet, but, um, I, we're going to have acrylic, acrylic, some gel and, um, bling. Okay. We're going to have a few of each, nothing too crazy because, um, uh, oh, you want a, a a monthly box? Yeah, make sure I drop them. I put the monthly boxes up for sale at 2 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. So just make sure to be on the website because some of them sell faster than others. It just depends on, I guess, the color, I want to say. That's Mother's Day weekend. <gasps> Wait, let me look at my calendar real quick. Oh, no, 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 no. I'll do it on um the week of the 15th, not on Sunday. I'll do it that week. So I'll put them up for sale before that the scoop party. ¿Cuál color estás pensando para el monthly box? I'm going to do them um yellow. Yeah, I'm not going to do the scoops on Mother's Day. It's just going to be the week of... It's going to be in that week, but, like, I'll put them up for sale around there. All right, so I'll put, like, a little leaf. I wish these were my nail beds, man. Fucking Marta, why are you going to have the best nails ever? You bitch. Why are you going to have good nail? Why are you going to have good nail, honey? Why, why, why? Oh, why, oh, why are you so fucking beautiful, Marta? I think that gel came a little lumpy from putting all them coats. Oh, I just love it. Tomorrow is a Zeho sub live. Be there or be simple or cry later. Tomorrow I'm going to do, um, I'm going to do, como se dice, um, I'm going to do some extendo nails. I'm going to do another one here. Zule, can I do nails while pregnant? I believe you can. I believe you can. I have seen plenty of people do it. Do nails. Preferably, I would um recommend for you to work in a well-ventilated area, of course. You know, because we don't want your little bun in the oven to get high. How much scoops be? Um, the acrylic is 40 cookies. Oh, fuck. My shit fell. The gel is also 40 cookies. And the bling scoops are 20. I hope I can catch the live tomorrow. I'm going to be at school. It's going to be at 6 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. So don't miss it. Are you doing Ryan Styles? Yeah, I'm going to do them long as fuck. I feel like the... Ex kind of like... Wait. Did I do your nails extendo, um, Mason? Your press-ons? Or were they Jens? Whose nails were extendo as fuck? Isn't Bling 30 cookies? No, it's 20 cookies. The Bling is 20 cookies, I think. I don't remember. Yeah, it's 20 cookies. 20 cookies. These nails remind me of Tequila Sunrise. Ooh, really? Yummy. Mine were the extendo tips, but you trimmed the bit off. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to use those nail tips tomorrow. I think those are the ones that Ryan gets. I'll probably have to trim a little bit, too. 
because honey, those are long, 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 long. Yeah, the bling is 20 cookies. I'm going to put some of our of our new crystals in there. Some of our new chatons. And um, some big ones. I think I'm going to put a, like two of these big ones. Let's see who's the lucky bitch that gets some. Two silver moonlight and two um two gold ones. <laughs> no trimming. We stingy. <laughs> Yeah, the scoops are fun. Well, they're fun for me. And Hep don't like them. He be mad as shit towards the end. Like, there, go to sleep. No more. Don't add no more. And then I be getting yelled at in bed. And I'm like, sir, why are you so mad? Gosh, you married a workaholic. Don't be getting mad at me now. You know what you signed up for, homie? A tank. Nah, but he just gets tired, grumpy. My presents from you are so framed and displayed. Ooh, yes, honey. I should probably do another giveaway, huh, for presents. I haven't done that in a while. I think I should for Mother's Day. Mother's Day press on giveaway. I'm convinced. Okay, fine. So tomorrow, I'll give away some press-ons to a subscriber. So you guys have to be there. If not, you won't win. So the way that I do it is I um get your name. Um, I get you guys' names while you are on the live. Okay, I'm like, hmm, let me give away a little press-on set. At 6 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. Have you been getting press-on orders? Actually, um, I don't think people know about the press-ons. I made them its own little category, but I don't, I, they're so far down the list. But for me, I'd rather not make them. They're just there because I promised them. But if nobody buys them, even better. But yeah, I'm gonna be doing a a press on set for um for a lucky subscriber. I'll do like flowers and bling for this set. I don't know. I'm already thinking about it. Like ooh, 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 ooh yes. So if you guys wanna win a press on set, you guys have to come tomorrow to my sub live, and you have to be present when I pull out you guys' names, cause. If not, you already know you're not going to win shit. And I'll try my best to have them done before Mother's Day so you could glue them on. I need a press on say yeah. All right, I'm going to do this one this way. I don't really like doing press on, so I don't really care if nobody buys them because I that's not what I'm trying to be doing. They're fun when I only do one or two. I don't know how people could do press ons for a living. Like, dude, that those stress me out. I guess because my nails get in the way. Right now, I'm going to add the purple flowers. They don't really need purple flowers, but I'm still going to add them anywhere. Ooh, look at those flowers. They look so cute. Ah, I love it. All right, let me close the, the Sharon color. They probably get used to it. Hmm? What are you talking about? They look like lotus flowers. So I'm going to do the purple flowers um, with a diamond. With a diamond in this game. Oh my god, what is that? I love the color combo. Thank you. I think it would make me sadness doing press-ons because I got no one to talk to. <laughs> That's true, huh? Like, who, who am I going to talk to? These plastic things? Working, doing only press-on sets. Ooh, okay, so this is the glue that I use. 
I just got a flower that looks like this. It's in my living room. Ooh, yes, honey. I wouldn't even know what the fuck this flower would be. But it's like in between like a rose and something else, huh? A rose. Marta always listens. All right, I'm going to put a flower. I'm going to put it right here. No sean codas. Echenle glue, eh? Echenle glue. I'm going to put it right here. Did you call Marta plastic to her face? <laughs> I don't know what. <laughs> I don't know what I said. <laughs> no, 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 no. What I meant to say was the press-ons. <laughs> The press-ons are plastic. <laughs> That's funny. Funny. Aw, oh, man. You know what? I, I should just leave the little clear there. Okay, hold on. Let me take it off. Let me move the diamond. I really like the clear in the nail. Talking about rose, did you get some more? I sure did. I ordered more, but they're not here yet. I'll let you guys know as soon as they arrive. I literally just placed my order because let me tell you guys what my mom and my cousins over here in Mexico, they're fucking planning on buying flores. They're going to come from Mexico to get some. I'm like, y'all crazy. I'm thinking I'm going to put a flower up there too, actually. All right, hold on. I'm going to put one over here. Zuley, can I add more items to my order when I purchase the scoops? What? Hold on. Let me read your comment. Zuley, can I add more items to my order when I purchase the scoops? For example, your glue and bond. Yes, you can. You can. But let me tell you. Okay, let's pretend. Let's pretend. Let's. Pre What's today? Tuesday. Let's pretend that I were to put the scoops up tomorrow pretend okay it's not happening um como se dice? and you guys order other things with your orders and let's pretend that the scoop party is not till next friday okay let's pretend okay um the reason why i tell people not to order stuff with their scoops if, if it's an emergency so like if you're gonna want your stuff asap then i say don't order other things with your scoops but if you're okay with waiting for everything, then you can, you know, because we normally scoop them like a few days later from the order. Sorry, guys, I was thirsty. Um, I sprayed the glue activator so my glue that I put on the crystals can dry ASAP because I don't want it to, <clears throat> to um, get on my brush. Does that make sense? <clears throat> I hope that made sense. So if you guys are planning to order more than just scoops, then um how to call it? Um just know that it can take a little while longer for, for it to ship. Like it won't ship that fast. Cause obviously we gotta scoop them first. I'm late. When is the scoop party? Um, We haven't decided the date. I'm going to just say probably on the 15th. I'm just going to say that date already, okay? The 15th or the 16th. I'll put them up for sale during um Mother's Day weekend. I'll put them up for sale Mother's Day weekend. So if you guys get money for Mother's Day... Or you can tell your kids, like, ¿saben qué? Yo no quiero rosas, mijos. Yo quiero scoops. Vayanme a comprar scoops mejor. You know? So they won't waste their money, your kids or your husband. They won't waste the money on those ugly flowers that are dying already on their way to dying. They could get you guys some scoops instead. <laughs> hold on, guys. Hold on. The purple acrylic takes a little bit longer to dry. So I have to give it time before I press it. 
Seriously, yeah. I told my mom the other day when we went to Costco, she's like, I'm going to buy you guys flowers for Mother's Day. I'm like, no, I don't accept flowers on Mother's Day because I feel so ripped off. Like, you can't even see the purple on here, but it's okay. I I don't really like flowers on Mother's Day because most of the flowers are already, like, off ugly. They're really off ugly and wrinkled and on their way out and shit. So I'm like, mm -mm, do not get me. And they're overpriced. I just got here. What kind of scoops are we having? We're going to have acrylic scoops, bling, and gel. If someone gives me flowers, at least let it be flowers I can plant and keep alive. Yeah, I would. those would die on me too. I'm not very good at, at taking care of stuff. I bought myself a long time forever flowers. So, I mean, those are cool, but I feel like they're a little too hyped i don't recommend them they're not all that in a bag of chips <clears throat> but the nails you can never go wrong with a flower on the nails i don't know i just don't take care of flowers so do not give me flowers because those shits will die better give me a a, a jello flower or something i love your life so much today i'm slowly losing my eyesight so hearing your voice gave me Gave me com oh gives me comfort. Ah, thank you for joining. Do bugs eat the forever flowers? Um, that's a good question. I don't think so. I don't think so because I don't know what they're made out of, dude. I just covered up my whole fringe over here. <laughs> that's what I do the best. This that's what I do the best. Cover up my decorations. Did you just say flowers are underweight? And no, I didn't say that. Did I? I don't even know what to say no more. I just said they're over expensive. They're too expensive. What's the best thing you've gotten for Mother's Day? Um, That's a good question. I don't remember what I've gotten for Mother's Day. But you know what I did tell Patrick I want? For Mother's Day, I want to go to Disneyland. That's what I said. <laughs> and he's like, I don't got I don't got money for a ticket for Disneyland. But I'll convince you to go. I'm like, sir, you do not need to convince me. I'm already. That should be in my cart already. This is like a Mother's Day design, huh? He better save up. <laughs> he better steal my money to buy me a ticket. The fuck? Let me add another leaf. Like, he, you better tell your dad to buy me tickets. The fuck? I'm like, yo voy a Disney antes del Mother's Day porque yo voy. Eh? Conocen ustedes. Excuse me. I love the flower. Yeah, these are early Mother Day inspo. So if you guys are going to um, recreate this, if you want to recreate it and you want more purple, I would say to don't really put white. I feel like the white takes over the purple or maybe I'm fucking blind. But I mean, they still look cute and shit. But if you want it to be more purple, then do a darker purple. He's really going to have to work overtime. Huh? He better paint some toenails. <laughs> Patrick is so fucking cute. He be making me fucking laugh. He my little broke bestie. The other day, I didn't even tell you guys. Did I tell you? Um, So we were eating ice cream. It was when El Jefe left to... He left to Fresno with his parents. Uh, me and Patrick were, were being lazy on a Sunday. I think it's been like two weeks or three. I don't fucking know. And I was telling him that when he gets older, he has to work really hard, save his money. So that when he wants to buy stuff, it doesn't hurt, right? Like he got enough money to buy it without him having to hesitate. Like, should I buy this or not? Like, but I really want it type of shit, right? 
So then I told him, I'm like, yeah, because just the way I work really hard to buy you your the stuff you want and need and everything. Um, when you get older, I am going to expect you to buy me coffees. And I told him, I'm like, you should be buying me a coffee sometimes. Like, surprise me. Damn. And then, how do you call it? Um, I was like, not expecting him to go buy me a coffee that day. I was like, oh. he. so he texts me and he goes like, let's go to Dutch. It's on me. And I'm like, you know, I'm going to say no. You know, I'm not going to say no to no coffee. So then we go to Dutch and he gets off the car and he goes to order and he didn't even get a drink for himself. I was like, where's your drink? And he's like, no, I just wanted to get you one. And I'm like, uh, I'm like, dear, I'm like, I wasn't expecting it that soon. But I was like, but where's your drink? And he didn't fucking get one. I'm like, <laughs> I wanted to cry. Because I was like, it's the chamacón, si me son caso. But I was like, that was so cute. I was like, I thought you were you were inviting me to Dutch because el antojo or something. But no, I'm like, this is so much caso que Lenny. Y so much caso que Lenny, el pinche pleo. Aha, so hopefully for Mother's Day, it will be the same. All right, that's enough flowers for Marta. She's running out of money. She's running out of money here. I'm going to put her some bling. He could learn to make you coffee at home. Saves money to go to make it. Well, yeah, he does. He knows how to make coffee. But how do you call it? Sometimes you just need Dutch. You just need a little Dutch. <clears throat> no, it's not missing a petal. I did it like that on purpose. I'm not done yet, so I can give you a price. But most of the nails that I do are over 200 cookies in this link because they're all long and shit. Long as shit. Hold on, guys. I just get a golden eagle. That's what I get. I'm going to add bling still. So should I put a butterfly? I feel like this set deserves a butterfly. Put a little diamond in there. If you guys want it, you could put gold balls in your flowers. That would look cute as shit, actually. Should I do that? Nah. Sometimes you just need Starbucks. Aha. Uh -huh. Like, I, Patrick makes me coffees for the most part at home. But, you know, Dutch is just, it hits different. Cute. Cute. Thank you very much, honeys. So, let me put a little diamond. I don't know. To me, a flower is not a flower if it doesn't have a bling. A butterfly. I have new butterflies, actually. Let me look. Let me look. Oh, I don't have a purple one. Hold on. Let me see if I have tweezers. One of my lovely followers, shout out to you. I forgot your name already, pero perdóname, amiga. She sent me this tool to pick up diamonds. I'm like, what? Look, we have a baby purple one. Oh, yes. Wait, I think this one is pink. It's not purple. I'm going to put it somewhere here. Oh, <laughs> yes. Honey. Look, guys, we have per We have more... Um. More butterflies. I've been wanting to do a purple set. I mean, a blue set. We have blue butterflies now. We have two different blues, actually. Look, if you guys like dark blue, we even have green, baby blue, crystal AB. That would look so cute, too. I love this look. Give me inspo for my nails. Oh, for a wedding next month? Cool. Oh, this charm is so cute. All right, I'm going to put that light pink on. Normally, I would do like a crystal AB, which is cute as fuck too, but this one kind of looks purple pink. So I'm going to do this one. I'm going to put it right here. Ooh, look at those kitties. Did you see my 420 scent? I saw somebody's 420 set. When did you post it? 
All right, I'm going to use my cluster gel for my batting fly real quick. I made it look easy. Um, It's because I've been doing it for a long time, guys. That's why it looks like I did it easy peasy lemon squeezy. But the more you guys practice, the easier... Ooh! The easier it'll be for you as well, okay? Did it have a spinning pipe? Oh, I, ha I did see a spinning pipe, but I don't know whose was it. Was it green? Did you do the pipe green? If I saw it, I liked it. I always like everybody's pose if I get to see it. All right, let me put that butterfly right there. Do the butterflies tarnish? Everything that's made out of like a gold um, metal will tarnish over time. Um, but I had a butterfly like this last time and it took a little while to start to change color. One thing that I do like to do um, to preserve it um, is... Oh, shit, hold on. Where's the button at? is to put top coat. So like, for example, this butterfly, I will paint it with top coat if you want it to last longer golden, right? But anything, any charm, any metal will tarnish, unfortunately. Do you recommend your cluster gel for small gems? Um, Yes, Kimberly, Um, you can use it for small gems or for clusters. <clears throat> Or even um, the little diamond shapes, whatever you like. I prefer the glue for the smaller gems only because I am impatient. But if you guys need time for your, um, for your decoration to dry and stuff like that, then yeah, you can use the gel as well. What did you glue the butterfly with? It's, um, I used the, the, the cluster gel. I glued the butterfly with the cluster gel, this one. So these big ass crystals, I glue them with a the cluster gel. All these big ones, I glue them with a the cluster gel. Things that are really heavy and bulky, I use a cluster gel for. All right, I don't know why, but I've been really into these little leafies. Should I add some to my website? I have a shit load. I think I do, actually. Just kidding. I'm not sure if I do. What your Texas class said about your yellow bling. Everybody in Texas was shook with, with my nails. All right, let me... I'm going to do like a little trail. This ain't Texas. I don't know why I love. I love little leaf stones. Yeah, I didn't know I had them. I think I have more. Um, I need to look at my stash before I even fucking open my mouth. Because I saw them in here. I'm like, ooh. I'm over here saying I have a shitload. I haven't even looked. But I do love them for like little corners. How do you display your charms? Also, do clients pick charms or do you? I actually don't display my charms. Um, I've never displayed them, but that would be a reason why my clients don't choose them maybe. Um, my clients don't really get charms. I'm not even going to lie. My clients have never really gotten charms. Um, I don't that's why I always say I don't really recommend buying a lot of charms, like all kinds of charms, just because you see them on on um online. Like just get what's in style at the moment. Oh my god, that looks like half a butterfly wing. Like this part, look at it. Like if it would be half a a butterfly. Doesn't that look like half a butterfly wing? Oh my god. I am so shook it. But yes, I was saying don't buy. Don't buy 
a bunch of charms that you don't even know if people are going to use, okay? Because let me tell you, that was my number one mistake as a beginner. I bought like a million and one charms and I still have them. I still have the motherfucking charms. Hi, Cynthia. How are you? I still have the charms, man. So some some customers just don't like charms because they don't like to get their hair pulled or whatever. But if you put them up, they'll probably see them and want them. What kind of stand is holding your hand? It's a stand from Red Iguana. Hola, Maggie. I'm on a charm kick. Oh, yeah. Well, if they're for you, definitely you will put them to good use. Um, but like clients, most the most clients don't really get charms. Well, at least charms, charms were not as popular for a long time. So I guess it depends on the trends, huh? Hold on. I'm trying to do a little squiggly here. My day was good. I was Senora Live for a little while. Yeah, like I'm not saying don't buy charms. I'm just saying don't buy excessive amounts, you know, because most of our clients will try charms once and then they'll be like, uh, I'm never doing that again. <laughs> At least mine, you know? No, the leaves are not on my website. I actually need to check to see if I have more. I'm over here saying that I'm going to add them to my store. But I don't even know if I have extra. I saw them in here. Like, they're all mixed. I even have a triangle, a square. I mean, what? I wish I had a little butterfly bling. Ma'am, the one thing we all have in common besides nails is hoarding. That is true as fuck. I'm just trying to tell you guys what I what I would tell myself my old new like if I could talk to my new nail tech self that's what I would say that's what I would tell myself about charms because I have so many charms at the salon that nobody ever touches I'm gonna have to start throwing them on my clients nails huh all right, hold on. Oh, yes, I have a little butterfly. I knew I had a butterfly. Yeah. I knew I had a little butterfly in there. I don't think it's called hoarding. It's collecting. <laughs> yeah, we are collectors. Well, I don't know what I'd be considered because should I put another charm? I'm a collector, but I use it on myself. It's definitely a collector. Mm -hmm. Like, just don't get high off your own supply, please. Like, Zule. Like, El Jefe would always be like, stop using it on yourself. It's for your clients. I'm like, sir. Bye. Bye. How are people going to trust me if they don't see it on me? Hello. Hello. I've always been a low-key little rebel, not going to lie. I'm an extreme collector. You know what? I really love this little leafy. Look at it just finishes a squiggle for you. Just like that and like this and like that in a soft fucking cute <clears throat> I feel like just like that they look so cute I love them I just need to clean the bottom because there's a little bit of alcohol on there hola saluditos they are marketing expenses in your advertising by wearing your nails mm Hmm. Do lady do you ever do p your pedicures live? No, I don't, Emma. I don't because um, I take too long. Kiroko bling. Do you sell a surprise bundle on your website? Mm, a surprise bundle? 
I do not sell surprise bundles on my website. I don't know what that is. Girl, I have charms right now and one got caught on my string. De mi calzón. I have to add. <laughs> what? Se te atascó la tanga, Marta? <laughs> charms are the devil sometimes, man. Oh, my God. Oh, mystery boxes. No, we don't have mystery boxes. But you know, we're going to have our monthly box on Wednesday. En la tanga. Se la toro en la tanga. La marta. La baren fly. I hope it was in a fucking baren fly. You know what? I've been wanting to do a fucking bow, a bling bow. Did you post a May box yet? No, I'll post it tomorrow. I haven't made it yet. That's why. I haven't made the box yet. I'll do it tomorrow in the in the day, during the evening or something. Oh my god. I'm getting sleepy. Um, I'll probably let my subscribers purchase first. If you guys are interested, because I'm gonna be at work on Wednesday. So if you guys are a Z Ho, I'll I'll probably give you guys first dibs on the monthly boxes while we're live tomorrow. I'm trying to become ambidextrous as well. You could definitely do it, honey. Yeah, Zulela's minute spontaneous. Uh huh. Yeah, cause I have to go to work. I have to go to work on Wednesday. So sometimes I forget when I'm at work to put up the box or things like that, right? I don't want to forget. Um, you can click the little star at the top. I'm not sure where. I think you click up here or that little star. And that's how you become to a, a subscriber. Don't forget, come tomorrow at 6 p.m. Pacific Standard Time um, to our sub live. I'm going to be giving away a press on set to one of my subscribers. All right, let me clean my bling. <sighs> Fuck, I'm so sleepy, bitch. How did I get so sleepy, honey? Yeah, let me clean the bottom. I got a little bit of alcohol down here. Gotta clean it. Alright. I haven't said it like that, huh? Like Mason in a long time. Alright. That's how he goes. Alright. Let me put on the rings on La Marta. What causes to be itchy? Uh, most likely. Um. Oh my god. Ay, Diosito, I'm so sorry. I don't mean to be yawning. I'm just really tired lately. Um, contact dermatitis, honey. We don't got no story time. What you mean? Oh, look, I'm gonna put Capricorn. My client here is a Capricorn. She wants to be a Capricorn gang. Ay, Diosito. I got my Buchona ring. Yes, honey. You guys can find our Buchona rings on the website. So check it out. This one is... I forgot what this one is called. Be My Valentine, I think. This one, you guys can find it on my website. Or um, this big one. Fire. The um, horoscope ones are on there too. Um, what else? The little flower one, I bought it from TJ Maxx, though. I want that one, but my size is not there. Yeah, if you guys are looking into getting rings, um, at least just for nail fees or whatever, you don't have to get them your size. Like, I regret buying all of them my size because... Oh, fuck, oh, fuck. I want them to fit mid-size for my pictures. Right here, it's 1020. It's 1020, but I'm sleepy. Do you get tired of doing nails? I do. I'm not even going to lie. I do get tired. <laughs> Let 
Look at this bitch. Oh my gosh. Que perra mi amiga. Que perra mi amiga. Fiu, fiu. If, if I did another hand. Oh my gosh. I'm so sorry. If I did another hand, I would flip the fingers around. I think I would add more Frenchies. They look so cute. That coqueta is coqueta. Yes, honey. Well, that's too dang bad. All right, let me give you guys a little close up real quick. Oh, que la verga, todo se me está cayendo. They're so shiny. My phone doesn't even want to. One more hand. Look at honey. She's adding more Frenchies. <laughs> more Frenchies to cover up, huh? What would you do on the thumb? I would probably do on the thumb the same as the pinky. Just because I really love that. Um, I would probably do this finger, this finger, and the thumb like this on the other hand. Because it looks so cute. And, like, maybe a, a whole nude nail would look fire for, like, the butterflies. Like, this little marble ombre would look cute on its own. But, you know, this bitch only has, she only has, um, four fingers. No mames, ya se le cayó everything. Oh, show the glow. Okay, hold on. Let me put you guys back up. Give me one second, please. I have to turn off the light. Meanwhile, let me put her to glow. Let's light her up. Hold on. Okay, la verga. Todo se me cae a la chingada a mí. Everything. Hold on, let me turn off the light. Let me turn up the light. How long did this take? I'll, um, give me a second, let me check. Two hours and 27 minutes. Damn, two hours? Wow, I finished kind of fast, huh? I need that tropical now. Every time I watch your live, I need that shit. Yeah, tropical is gorgeous. The other, the other orange one is called um, um, it's called Sharon. Look it. Ooh, even the flowers are glowing. Hold on, let me turn off my phone so you guys get the full glow. Wow, even the jar is glowing. Like, hold on. The more light you guys put, the more it glows. Hold on, guys. Let me put it a little bit longer. So pretty much they're like little solar panels. The more you're out in the sun, exposed to the light, the brighter they glow. Look it. Zoom, 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 zoom. It's like lava, baby. Lava, 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 lava. So if you guys want your little nails to glow a lot, a lot, you have to go out to the sun, take a little walk. They're so cute, huh? I'm glad you guys love them. Well, thank you guys so much for joining me tonight. I'll see you again tomorrow at 8 p.m. I mean, just kidding, not 8 p.m. At 6 p.m. Pacific Standard Time um, on the Zeho Live, okay? So everybody else, if you guys are not subscribed, I apologize, but you guys will not be able to see the live. Um, <clears throat> yes, pick up the color, y'all. Sharon, yes, this, this one is called Sharon. All right. Bye, everyone. See you later, alligators. Thank you for all the little likes.
Um, tomorrow we're going to do some extendos, okay? So be ready to sit for a while. All right, buenas noches. I'm going to try my best. To um, tomorrow we're going to do some extendos, okay? So be ready to sit for a while. All right, buenas noches. I'm going to try my best. Una noche más y copas de más. Tú no me dejas en paz. De mi mente no te...